Everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you're new, my name is Ben. I'm a runner who's also a running coach who specializes in human optimization in order to improve performance. In today's video, I'm gonna give you six reasons why I think every runner should be incorporating trails to help improve health and performance. So let's get into it. Reason number one, less impact on the body. Running is a single leg sport. Every time you take a step, that's at least twice your body weight going through each leg. When we think of running on concrete, it's a very unforgiving surface, which mean that means that the body has to work twice as hard to absorb the training in. When we run on trails, it's more natural terrain, which means we absorb the training a little bit easier, which means that you're gonna get more benefit from running back to back on trails than if you were running on concrete. Reason number two, it gets you out into nature. Being in nature not only has physical, but mental benefits. One, it helps to reduce stress, which means you can absorb the training in. The second thing, it helps you to protect you from the weather, depending if it's summer or winter. When it's summer, running on trails keeps you nice and cool, which means your heart rate will stay lower. In winter, when it's windy and wet, it protects you from them elements, which will also keep your heart rate nice and low. Reason number three, it helps to build strength. Trails are uphill and downhill, but when it comes to running uphill, this is great to help strengthen the posterior chain. And that just means your back, your glutes, your hamstrings and calves. When you are running or walking uphill, depending on what you need to do, you're gonna be engaging these muscles so much more, also improving your knee drive. So when you run on the flat, you'll find that you'll be able to generate more power, which speeds you up. Reason number four, it helps to build speed. When you are running downhill, you need to have a quick turnover, otherwise you're gonna fall over. So this is a fantastic way to build cadence. On top of that, you need to stay light on your feet, which means that you're gonna land on the balls of your feet, which is ideal technique. From here, when you're running downhill, your heart rate actually decreases, so it's not gonna go too high, which means you can run a bit faster. So if you are looking to build speed, this is a great way to incorporate speed training whilst keeping your heart rate nice and low. Number five, it helps to build the aerobic base. When you're running trails, you're gonna be going uphill, which means that you're gonna to have to slow down to make sure that your heart rate isn't too high. Walking is fine and unexpected. It allows you to connect with spending time on your feet instead of looking at Ks, and it helps to build strength, power, and endurance. Reason number six, it keeps you present. When you're running on trails, the terrain is always changing, so you've got to stay focused. If you don't, you're gonna get injured, which is gonna take you out of training. So it is, I find it quite meditative being outside and focusing on my run. I do not have any headphones on because I've got to stay engaged. I also find running trails to be fun as well. And I find that it allows me to focus on my reactive skills because I've got to react to the environment and the terrain altogether. That's my six reasons why I feel every runner should do trail running. Now, if you like the video, you know what to do, like. If there's any questions, put them in the comment section below. Remember to follow me on IG, so that is Instagram and Facebook. And if you have any personal questions, please feel free to reach out to my email. And remember, you got to move to improve. And it's not about how much training you do, it's about how much training you can absorb. And I'll see you on the next one.